Hi, I'm Mary Hevron, Mayor of Leonia. There's been a lot of scuttlebutt about the coming primary election on June 7th. And I want to give you some factual background and urge you to vote in this all-important election. Our Municipal Committee has always supported me, both for my three terms on the Town Council and then as Mayor. Always, that is, until June of last year, when 12 new members were elected to the committee. People I had never seen at a single meeting in all 13 years of service. I wrote them a congratulatory note expressing my hope of hearing from them. The only person I heard from was Chairman Bob Lee, who expressed surprise that I was standing for re-election. Although I asked repeatedly to be invited to a municipal committee meeting, as had been a standard courtesy the committee extended to previous mayors, no invitation was ever proffered, and I wasn't even informed as to when these meetings were taking place. It became clear that a political plot was being hatched. When I mentioned my fears to State Senator Loretta Weinberg and Assemblywoman Valerie Huddle, I was assured that incumbent mayors were always supported by municipal committees, unless something truly egregious, some ethical, moral, or legal impropriety had been discovered. Nevertheless, some weeks later, I received an email from the Leonia Municipal Committee Chair that I would not be the organization's candidate. It was only through the grapevine that I learned that the committee had selected John D. Simone, owner of Moore's Hardware, a person whose sole experience with any governmental board consisted of a half year's membership on the council. The political implications of this scenario were now crystal clear. Equally clear were the messages I received from countless supporters who urged me to run on the independent democratic line. In deciding to heed this outpouring of support, I declared my candidacy for re-election. And I am happy to support Gil Hawkins and Doug Salmon for counsel. And now I'd like to say a word or two about the reasons for my decision. Anyone who has ever seen me in action will acknowledge my experience, my unstinting passion for work, I have never missed a single meeting since I was elected 13 years ago. And my eagerness to listen to the comments and suggestions of the people of Leonia. I run tightly organized meetings and my campaign literature concisely lists the specific accomplishments that have already taken place during my administration. In a new term, I would expect to continue discussions with the new superintendent as well as the principals of ACS, Leonia Middle School and Leonia High School. I would like to add to the advisory committees that we have created. More input from education and middle school student advisory committees would be high on my list of priorities. If you have not yourself been involved, I urge you to ask more active neighbors about me. They will testify that I stand for honesty and openness, that I am no mere puppet, that I have brought back respect for the office of mayor and restored people's faith in local government. I have stood up for Leonia in the past and I hope you will let me continue to stand up for Leonia in the future.